the Public Interest and Accountability Committee, PIAC, is raising concerns about the abuse of the petroleum revenue by government. The committee cites instances where the funds were used to pay old debt, some even unbudgeted for. Speaking in a yet-to-be-aired exclusive interview with Joy Business Technical Manager at PIAC, Mark Ajiman said, the practice is against public financial management and also raises value for money concerns. The projects are commendable, others are not. Others are in the deplorable state, others uh, have started even deteriorating before even commissioning, and others too, because of the way they've scattered what we call thin spread of the money, go to a project and it's just about 50,000 Ghana cities of oil money. That is in the project that cost about 46 million Ghana cities. So that makes uh, proper accounting for the petroleum revenue in that project very difficult because when you go to the site and you don't know what the 50,000 Ghana cities came to do. What we've also noticed through this uh, monitoring exercise is that some projects were completed as far back as sometime 2008, 2009, 2010. And in 2019 or 2018, they are using petroleum revenues to pay for outstanding debts. Another thing we've also noticed is that because there's lack of proper planning in executing these projects, most of the projects, especially road projects, delays and therefore brings its cons uh, consequences of uh, cost overruns. Sometimes a project is initially estimated to cost 6 million Ghana cities. Because of delays and variations, five years later you go and it has ballooned to sometimes 20 million, 30 million Ghana cities. That is not proper use of petroleum revenues or even national uh, 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 resources as a whole.